Hey, what's up everyone? It's your friend 23 here and I'm back with another Zelda Tear of the Kingdom video. And today we're gonna open this door, hopefully. We have completed the three sh shrines that we needed to complete. That one. And where is the second one? It was somewhere over here. There it was. Uh, that's the first one. Yeah, and then we had one all the way over there somewhere. So those three we have done. And let's continue. Okay. So the door opens. So my boss theory might be wrong. <laughs> it would be so funny if it's like... Here is Zelda, GG, now the game is over. We have these things from the from the opening scenes, the nine, uh, the, the thing that looked like a nine, and also these things that I tried to climb up to. Okay, let's just see what's happening now. There she is. And now the end screen. Congratulations, you have completed the game. Not really, right? <laughs> Bit too bright for my taste. This scene. Is she healing my arm? Is... Does this mean that Zelda is dead or... That she feels like a spirit as the, the other guy that gave us the arm? We got something at least. Maybe our old powers back from the first game? Some of them, the, the magnetic thing and everything. <laughs> That scene was pretty unclear, <laughs> if you ask me. We got recall. Reverse an object's movement until it goes back to where it was. You can stop the reverse movement at any time. Okay. Hmm. Ah, recall. The ability to reverse the movement of an object through time. So Zelda wasn't here. And Zelda vanished as well. Mm. What you just saw? It's a mystery even to me. Perhaps it was some sort of echo. One that... Oh. One that reflects her sheer will. <laughs> that you now have been given this ability. No doubt it will be... Prove important. Probably it will prove important in this little building if I can... Oh, sorry. I just need to take a gum to get some more saliva so I can talk. Uh, probably we're gonna use it here, if I can... If I can... Um, make an educated guess. <laughs> that was a strong gum, sorry. I will try to edit that sneeze out. But if I forgot, forget, I apologize. Okay, so we want to rewind this, dude. That means I can jump on it. Wow. I'm the worst aimer worldwide. If I wanna... Yeah, okay. So now... Let, let, it, let it go a bit more, a bit more. There is good. And now we want to rewind. 
Jump. That was my plan the first time. <laughs> and I... Yes, okay. Now we don't want to rewind, because then we can go back here. Nice. And just rewind this, dude. This makes sense. This isn't this the shrines from the from the first game? The goddess statue smiles upon me. I wanna pray once more. Pray once for me and pray once for Zelda. One for Link, one for Zelda. That's perfect. I don't know what it did. <laughs> Maybe it restored my life, but I already had full life. Push. Okay. Okay, so Zelda is probably in there. I need more life. You remain in a weakened state. You're not strong enough to open it. But there is one more shrine on this island. There you can get another blessing. If you add that to the other blessings, you receive a tr If you add that to the other blessings, you receive at the shrines and offer them all to the goddess. You might just find a way forward after all. Mm. Exactly. Let me see the Pura pad. So those goddesses was from the old game, but not in the shrines. It's those that you upgrade your life and stamina at. The Pura pad lets you travel to certain places instantly. Nice. Now we get the the instant travel. You can travel instantly to any of them. I suggest the one at the bottom of your map. Use the travel function to reach that area quickly. You will find the last of the island's shrines around there somewhere. Okay, nice. Thank you for that quest. So updated. Uh, map. And quick travel. Ah, okay, okay, I, un I get it. Now we can do these ones. <laughs> Damn, that's actually great. Great level design. But how? That's the question. Oh yeah, I'm stupid. I have the ascend thing, you know. What is this? Map? What a weird thing to have... I don't want my map there, I, I already have my map. That's actually a bit weird. Okay, so rewind. Almost fell there. Jump. Nice. Should be it. Yeah. And then we can stop that. Okay. So where are we embarking now? We're still on this, you know, the island in the sky. So I guess we're gonna get out on this island, but maybe somewhere else. Here is the shrine. I thought we would... Explore for a bit before we found it, but I guess there it is. Let me just talk to this dude This is a crystal refinery I Can take your crystallized charge and use them to produce energy wells Any oh wrong button. Sorry What are Crystallized Sunlight can be ex oh, I forgot to read some. Uh, yes, crystallized shards are materials used in the creation of energy wells. They are made by processing sonite. Sonite can be excavated even in the mining caves on this island. Okay. Though there's very little left there, it is unlikely you will find enough to produce an energy well. So it's an energy well, is it that like a permanent or is it a thing up in the right corner there? Will I begin production? Sure. I'm not sure what this is, but... 100? 
One note regarding the soul knight required to protect crystallized charge. The mines on the island have nearly run dry. I doubt there's enough left to produce an anything. But there's more to be had. Check that distant death of the world below. That is the original source. Okay. So I can't... <laughs> I can't produce enough for now. And this is just when I'm going back, I'm presuming. I'm gonna go back to the shrine. I just wanna see what is out here. Okay, so you're gonna do the shrine and then... Then we're gonna fly down again to the... Ooh, maybe we should land on the top of the... Temple of Light, or was it, was it called that? And also we... Before we do the shrine, let's go up here. I can promise you, you have a Kuroko seed up here. I saw a big trunk. this even and even a small little chest for me here that's great three wings I never have too many wings I feel like I'm gonna use the flying thing a lot in this game it was really smooth okay so, Kuroko seed. I probably should stand on this until it falls down or something. I oh, just press A. I did find you. It was pretty obvious. Thank you. Anything else up here? Can I just... for a bit here. Doesn't look like it. Let's go down and do the shrine. Yes, it's time. Oh. Can I do the re the rewind time on these guys. Okay. You're a scared bunch. Now when I think about, couldn't I have just used the ascend when I was inside the tunnel to to get up here without climbing. It's these new things, you have to get used to them. I, probably I could have. <laughs> but I took the old way around. Let's, let's see if I could have. Somewhere, yeah, I could. Oh well, great for next. Next time I'm in a cave. Let's do the fourth and last shrine on this island. The ability to rewind. I guess this is pretty straightforward. Jump on this. Oh! Maybe straightforward if you have the right ability out. Now, we have to wait for the next one. Probably wanna stand here also just to make it even if it's a bit early, even easier. So rewind. Thank you. Ah, so it shows you with a line where it's going also, that's nice. Can we Oh! Oh! Please! I have time. I don't wanna wait for the next one. Nice. Uh, so I will fly up with this, yeah, okay, nice. Let's go and take this chest. Okay. 
It's nice that it has like one second before it starts rewinding, so you have time to get on. I really enjoy that. Ten arrows. I never complain about getting free arrows. Okay, I understand. I have to do it on bow? Oh. I don't understand. Maybe I do. I think I do. Ah! God damn. That was failed by me. So when they line up, I should just aim on the white one. So, now? Perfect. And that's it, I guess. For that shrine. And we skip this. So now we have seen it four times. Light of Blessing. Now we have four. Now we're gonna fly. That's the thing I'm most hyped about. And I still can't get over the fact that this is the tutorial island. Like we have almost... It's four episodes and we haven't left it yet. So around four hours of gaming soon. Without leaving the tutorial tutorial island. That's... That be bodes well for the, for the game. Okay, we should fuse. But first we need to... Take out one of the fans. It's always more fun to have a fan on. That. And then we lift it. Can we just push? We don't have to push it. We can just land this here. Nice. And then we hit it. Let's go. Ah, oh, this is so great. We can even turn it off and just glide for a bit. That's so nice. <laughs> oh my god. Like, the only thing I'm gonna do in this game is climb up to these mountains in the sky and just sail down. <laughs> this is such a nice experience. Turn on the motor, because we want to go down a bit quick. <laughs> okay, you can do it like that also. <laughs> Why not? Ah, I failed. I feel like you have a lot of great things up there. That I now miss out on. It made us come here quickly though, which is nice I guess. <laughs> Can we even see the flying thing? Or is it gone? It's almost that I want to load a previous save and do that again. But no, let's make this playthrough as organic as it can be. If I fail, I fail. I probably could have even maybe fast traveled. I could travel there, but what's the fun with that? I like how all these abilities that you have learned here, they come really naturally. It's a nice feeling. This is slow though. Now, talk to this girl, pray some bit more. So what would happen, can you even, if you could choose here between stamina and health? Oh, you can only do heart. Would be fun if you took stamina and then was like, okay. All well, the game is over.
Heart container, a rare item that restores some of the life force you lost to the glue, increasing your maximum number of hearts by one. Oh. Now we should be able to open the door, I guess. I'm just gonna hold here until it opens or until I die. That felt almost scripted. What would have happened if I flew over and landed with my thing without opening this door? Because <laughs> it felt like you could almost fly that far. Because he was so high up. Ah, oh, good. I see you have managed to open the door. All thanks you to you. Fully recovered yet, but that is to be I expected. Know. We're almost beyond saving. My life is in um, debt to blessings. this dude. You have mitigated some of the corruption's effects. Though our time together has been brief, I am so happy that we finally met. Same here. He has a third eye, also. That's a nice little detail. But it's closed. So he's not woke anymore, he's sleeping. I've done everything I can for her. Now it is up to you. Okay. Goodbye, my dude. I hope I will see you sometime again. Soon, in the future. Please. Don't leave me. Find person, persons, <laughs> persons, Princess Zelda. After you offered your light testing to the goddess that you purge gloom from your body, you're far from being reformed. Blah 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 blah. I only said the thing that happened there. I. Maybe not rewind. Eh. I guess. We jump down. So the thing is, is, is this the thing like, okay, did I jump here? Or am I stupid? Ah, oh, of course I shouldn't jump, I should use this. See? I have already forgotten this ability. <laughs> nice. Same thing here. This time you won't fool me. What is that over there? Some kind of light? Let's examine. My broken swords starts talking. Will this restore the sword? It cannot be. Not this early. Do I give it up? It restores it, huh? But maybe not to the full point. And there is Zelda. Okay, so it restores it to Zelda. That's weird. So she knows that I'm here or something.
Link is like, what the hell? Where's my sword? Now the real world is opening up for us. Nice. Link. This is hype. Zelda, I will rescue Link. you. You must, you find, must me. find me. Goosebumps. To the kingdom of Hyrule. We got a new main quest here. And we updated this one. We must find her. Where is she? I don't know. Was there anything more she was trying to tell you? Maybe. At the Temple of Time, you saw the Master Sword vanish into a mysterious light. A white dragon then rose to the sky, parting the sea of clouds. You're sure you heard Princess Zelda say, Link, you must find me. Head to the land below to look for clues to her, to her whereabouts. There is no faster way than to dive bravely from the Sky Island. I guess that's what we're gonna do here. <laughs> and to be smart, we should dive where it's water. Let's dive here. Huh. Let's quick dive this. Sh or now, nah, I wanna see the world, how big it is. Oh. Nice. Let's dive down now, to the mainlands. This is hype. Now, the game begins. Four hours later. <laughs> and we got a Hyrule Bass. Here we are. Hyrule Kingdom. So I guess a good objective here in the beginning, because I have no clue what we should do. We should just explore is what we... Okay, so we can change layers, nice. Maybe we should just go to this thingy. That can be a good start, because I want some, some type of objective that we will work against now. We can just... Ah, here we have something. Dazzle fruit. A fruit... Okay, so it's basically lightning fruit. We can throw them as well. So how do you throw things? No. Maybe I should have uh, checked the controls when it told me, but I have the special controls here. Uh, throw material. Hold to get ready. Okay. Is that... No, that's not correct. Okay, I understand. Hmm. I didn't think these sky shrooms would be on the ground. I thought they were only gonna be found up in the air. <laughs> I, I don't have energy. I was like, can't even climb this little thing. Dear, it looks like a lot of material to build. A house or something? Maybe we should go and check it out. Oh! How was it you... I remember you could like grind on your... On your shield? Like that. Jump and uh, A. That's good to know. Oh! My first enemy, ground enemy. I wonder if you should taste my fire shield. Why not? <laughs> I still don't have my uh, glider. That's a thing I really want. That would change the whole game. Okay, so 
Have they really made like paper leather or something? No. Can I grab it? No. Can I do anything with it? Can I burn it maybe? Let's try burning it. Oh. But please stand straight ahead. Broke. Let's try burn it with this one. Nothing, huh? Does it say anything here? Hyrule Restoration Material. Use this material materials cache for all your building needs. Come find us if you would like a dream home. Hudson Construction. Ooh. Gonna build a home in this game, right? So with this, I should probably be able to make some kind of... Some kind of... Uh, buy? Uh, like... Car? But I'm not sure if I want to take on that project at the moment. Or maybe I won't. Maybe I won't. It's, it's far. <laughs> I'm traveling far now. So let's try build a, building a car. Let's see if I have the IQ for this. This stone is gonna make me irritated. So throw it away. Okay, so we want wheels. And the wheels should stand up. So if I just do that... I need to raise my... My platform for the car. So I will just put that one there. And then let's put that one on top of here. To raise it. Then we should have... Then we should be able to... Nice. And then it's easy to just do the same on the other side. Well, on the same side, but in the back. Can we just... Push this little thingy? Like that? No! Don't... Don't attach it. Thank you. That was a bit scuffed. The only thing I'm wondering is... I know how to get like power on it, but how should I be able to steer it? <laughs> I don't have a steering wheel. Take away this. Okay. So on this car we should have... Maybe if you like put things on the side that also blows wind. Because then you can like turn it on and off when you want to steer. So then I need four motors if I want to go... S I Ahead and to the back. I'm gonna take out two because that's all I have. I'm gonna put one in the in the front, so you can back it up, and one in the back, so you can go forward. It depends on which way you're going. Maybe it would have just been easier. Actually, just uh, having three. Okay, let's try this thingy. Maybe it will work, maybe it will not work. Both are turned on. That's a problem. Can't I just hit one of them? To both... Okay. Well, that... Uh, that made my theory not hold up at all with having like these on the side as well to make me steer 
But maybe I can just steer it somehow. I just... No, I cannot. Oh well. Let's just enjoy this. <laughs> Little ride straight ahead. Wow, this is crazy. That this is Zelda. <laughs> Let's see what we have. Can we have a... It would be nice if you could like use... I don't think it's possible, but I want to try. Oh, don't want that. Can you like have one of these as a steering wheel? So if we try to put it in the front here. <laughs> this will not work. But let's try it. Yeah, that doesn't work. It looks cool though. It's like on um, uh, cars you have like the brand in the front. It's like that. So I guess you just have to take your car up and then like rotate it where you want to go. So I want to go on this road now, here. Let me line it up for me. So now you can do like drive-bys with your <laughs> your goddamn bow on the enemies. That's crazy. Now I don't have the sword left. But maybe if I have this one? That blows some wind. Can I? And I would turn it off. Just except for now that you can't steer the the car. That you even can build a car is. It's more crazy than. More than I have ever could have dreamed on in, in this game. I'm just gliding away here. Can chill if I want. Sit down. I guess if you have two motors, you would go extra fast. I should have not left the other motor. There's a shrine. I wanna just... I guess this high platform thing is this one and you see one over there. And also one there. I guess those are the ones to unlock the map. As the... Same as the last game. My, my things are gonna <laughs> break before just by turning on and off my car so I need to go here and fight some some mobs so I can get some more items so what we're gonna what are we gonna do here we're gonna start with a bow and maybe I'm not sure what we're gonna Fire. Always good to start with fire. I'm probably on that dude up there. Oh, they have found me. This is not good at all. Some fire on them. Why not? This <laughs> shield is so strong. Ah. Oh, not two handed. Too slow attack speed. But I managed to not get hit. Rock hammer, okay. Traveler spear. That's gonna hit me. Yeah, I didn't have time. Book lobbing horn, a sharp one with multiple barbs. Attach it to a weapon to increase its attack power. Nice. So let me just chill here. Let's snipe him just. Boom. Not a headshot. Not a headshot. This should be a headshot. That wasn't a headshot. It looked like it. Can I take this? Yeah. A lot of loot. A lot of arrows. What is this type of chest? 
the poor man's chest. Should have used those on the training island for all the crappy loot they had in the beginning there. Because when you see those big chests, you're like, damn, that must be some crazy gear or something. And then it's like, you got three, hour, three arrows, or five arrows. Bukobo, can't carry it. Do I have... Yeah, I got better bows. I wanna try this on an, some type of item. Oh, now I dropped my bow. Let's try it on this one. So if I wanna choose it... I should just drop it, right? And not throw that. And use. Use it with my stick. Now I wanna change. I don't wanna make my fire shield break. That made it do 8 damage instead of... Or two. That's pretty strong. Okay, we got something new. Hyrule her. Okay, I want my uh, car. I have grown attached to my beautiful car now. This car will be with me the whole playthrough. Looks like an okay angle. And hit it. <coughs> oh, it's nice <clears throat> that the walls are like capturing you into the road. That's a smart fix of them. But I hope you can like attach some type of steering wheel later. That would have been such a fun ex extension. Okay. I need to park my car somewhere not in the road. That's a great parking. That's a great parking. Okay. So this is like a small town I guess. Let's talk to these dudes, if they have something to say. Even Pura's stomped. And who is Pura? What are you watching? Dude. You might be tripping or something, because I, I don't see anything up there. It's hard to believe these ruins just fell from the sky. I mean, they're from an age of legends, and now they're here. Yeah? It's all so strange, huh? Yeah, it sure is. But it's also a great opportunity. All of us on the Sonia survey team should count ourselves lucky. If it weren't for the upheaval, this never would have happened. Not that anyone knows the upheaval, what the upheaval even is. Mm. Well, Pura's looking into it. She's holed up. She's holed up in her research lab inside the fort, trying to make sense of things. Are they like talking to me or to each other, and I'm just <laughs> listening in? She figures if she's better she figures if she's better understands the upheaval, she will find some sort of lead on the princess. But so far nothing. Uh... Is the princess alright? Wherever she is. These runes right here are except exceptional, but really, who cares about that at a time like this? Dude, stop being such a simps for Zelda, that's my girl. You can, you can focus on the ruins. Let me focus on Zelda. Lookout landing. Mom, Dad, I'm home. Those footsteps. Can it be? Is it Link? Is this their researcher? Robbie. Ah, what an excellent night. Hey, hey, you. Where have you been? Robbie, head of Purapad development. That's a shad. Don't answer that. Tell me later. For now, you should hurry and go talk to Pura. She's been in a tizzy ever since you and Princess disappeared. She's in the building with the telescope. Up on the second floor. Where's the telescope? 
to this one, maybe. Uh, go see her and give her some peace of mind, will you? Of course. But first I need to check out this cool town. Talk to this girl. <laughs> that's not a girl, that's a dude. Uh, maybe, I'm not sure. Doesn't matter. It can be whatever that person wants to be. So those balloon things that fell from the sky are called Sonai devices. There's still so much we don't know about them. But trust my boss, Pura, to take a thing we know so little about and turn it into something useful. He's the sharpest person in Hyrule, a creative genius. Okay. So where is the tel- oh, that's the telescope. Because that's probably where you unlock the map. Can I do that first? Would have been great. And also, I just want to take a quick look around here. This is some nice, nice looking game design. Chopping wood. Yeah, I'm gonna talk to some of them, these guys later. I wanna see that, you see this board over here? I wanna see what this says. <laughs> is it like a tutorial how to fight? That's some cute drawings. And like, these, are these breakable? No? I guess this... This area maybe is like a safe heaven? Okay, let's continue on the main quest here. I also saw here... Arrows with my name on it. Wait a minute! What do you think you're doing? Yeah, I, I imagine that this was a store or something. Yosha need that for her chas chaos K chasm research. Don't touch any of it without her permission. I'll get in big trouble if you do. Okay, I will not take anything here then. So let's go and see this Pura lady. That's what everybody tells me to do to go and do here. Doc Charlotte's busy. Is this Pura? No, that's Yosha. That hair, those eyes. The, the, doc. Dr. Pura. The swordsman. The swordsman has returned. I have. But without our princess. <sighs> okay. Now, where have you been? That's a long story. Linky, you're not a ghost, are you? Do I look like a ghost? Hey. That looks interesting. It is interesting. Phew. One step at a time. Why is she holding a flute? What exactly happened? That's a great looking doc uh, scientist slash doctor. <laughs> I guess a lot of people will crush on her playing this game. Friendship has ended with Zelda. So now Pura is my Zelda. new Go beneath Hyrule Castle. BFF. You discover a mysterious mummy which suddenly reanimates. Pretty much. Then Zelda falls into a fissure and vanishes. True words. That must have been when the castle rose and the ruins fell. That's some great um, reasoning from your side. You wake up on a sky island, saved True. by the arm that was stuck to the mummy. You get the Pura pad from an unusual creature. The switch, you mean? That your new arm belonged to someone named Raru. My brother, my brother. The master sword disappears. Oh no, where is you it? Hear the princess's voice and find your way here. Yeah, pretty much. Sums up the first four hours. What? Then? What? Are you saying you came from up there? This Rauru you met. I think that's what the first king of Hyrule was named. Hmm. Are they one and the same? 
so much of this doesn't make sense yet. Still, not never gonna make sense. For me at least. But I'm certain that mummy you found under the castle must be related to the upheaval. Yeah, probably. Hmm. The castle rising up, the ruins falling down from the sky. The mummy must be connected to it somehow. Ah. And then there is the most important detail of all. You're sure that you heard the princess speak to you? And she gave you a clear message to find her? Is that truly was... was if that truly was the princess, then that means she's alive. They usually are alive in these games. Maybe she's trapped beneath the castle and needs help. Hmm. That's a spin of the story, right? Stuck beneath the Hyrule castle. Uh, that, that settles it. I know you only just returned, Link. But you cannot rest. But I need you to meet with the search party up by Hyrule Castle. They've been searching tirelessly for you two. The captain in charge of the search is named Hoss. Work with him and find the princess as quickly yes. as you can. I know that mummy may still be lurking somewhere around here, which is concerning, to say the least. But we have more immediate problems to deal with right now. I'm counting on you, Linky. Stop calling me Linky. I have never given you permission of co to call me that. Pura, the highest authority on ancient technology. She has saved Princess Zelda's family for much of her life and has worked with the princess to s research the Sonai civilization. Most recently, they started, to an in they started an investigation into the outbreak of gloom. She has used herself as a test subject in her experiments, despite being over a century in age. Then she looks great for being over a century in age. She, rever she reversed her aging to the extreme and actually looks... And actually looks like a child not too long ago. That's some classic anime shit. make her like 25 or something. First page. On that day, the land shook and the huge chasm seemed bottomless open in the ground. The clouds billowed and rolled as floating islands appeared in the sky, raining chunks of ruin down on us. And strange of all, Hyrule Castle began to float in the air. It's hard to believe, blah 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 blah. Whoever start is called... Is this even... Air. Gloom is something I want to know about. Uh, we decide to call the island hanging in the sky, Sky Islands. It's a fitting name. Simple and to the point is best, it seemed. I suspect, I suspect based on the design motifs, motifs on them. I suspect based on the design motifs on them that the ruins fall, the ruins falling from the sky are Sonian in origin. We still understand so little about the Sonian civilization. All we know is that it's flourished in the sky. Well, it's true that the upheaval has posed major problems in every aspect of life in Hyrule. I cannot deny it presented us with an opportunity to answer questions we long had about our history. Hmm. We started an investigation the fallen ruins in Sky Island. Our best lead is to report from the chief of the Karaoke village that some unusual ruins and engraved slabs have fallen there. I decided to have the Sonai survey team work out the Kakri Kaka Kakariko village in Nekluda, southeast of Lookout Landing. The ruins that fell on Kakariko village are massive. You can see them from all the way here at the Lookout Landing. The crater left by the castle is castle's rise is still spewing gloom. Oh, the gloom is the red thing, the evil energy. It's kept us from making any progress with our investigation. We still don't know anything about where the princess and Link have gone. The upheaval occurred very soon after the princess Zelda and Link left to explore beneath Hyrule Castle. Okay, so now she can update that text with I'm back, baby. Yeah. Can we climb up here? I did like... I was sick of Zelda, so I just took care of her, and now everybody thinks she's just gone. 
That would have been a nice little twist. Even more books. Should I read her diary? I don't like reading in games, but sure. A stairway leading deep beneath Hyrule Castle has been discovered. Even Princess Zelda didn't know about it. So it seems safe to assume it's a secret removed even from the royal legend. We've confirmed that gloom emanates from that location, meaning something down there must be causing it. I pointed Princess Zelda and Link to investigate. Actually, it would be more accurate to say that Princess Zelda volunteered for the job before I had the chance. I know beyond a doubt there is no team more qualified for such a task, and yet, I can't escape the feeling of dread. I've decided to store this diary in four volumes, that way, if a noisy someone reads it, they only have a quarter of it. Such ideas are the fruits of genius, yeah? As for the first one, I think I'll entrust it to who else but Impa. Speaking of Impa, she had a cute habit of hiding important items underneath things ever since she was a child. I have a fond memory of when she forgot about a hidden steamed bun beneath a cushion and then sat on it, washed flat. This is nonsense. Diaries are flat to begin with, but as they are more important than a bun, I hope she finds a better hiding spot for that than a cushion. Then it's probably in a cushion. Is it... Is it here that person sleeps? I don't know. I feel it's not that important at the moment. Let's see what we have more. It's great fun to just see how the artwork here is. So they have probably is it they have drawn out some of the island skies. I'm not sure. Also, can we just read this thing again? Is Zelda, yeah. But why do... Are they like one and the same person? Why are they both there? Let's see here. I wanna go up here and then we can maybe... Because she told me to take a look, if I remember correctly. But I'm not sure what I should look for. Let me just... Oh, that's a slow... Okay, you can only do it like this. I thought you could like look at 360 degrees. There we have a shrine. And the castle. Very nice, very nice. A lot of gloom. A lot of gloom. And that's the top. Okay. Very <laughs> unnecessary, but now we've done that as well. Let me just jump down here. I think I'm gonna heal up for a bit. With a one of those. So what was the objective? So we can so we know what we're gonna do the next episode. So we're gonna go to the Hyrule Castle. The Hyrule Castle rose into the air at the start of the upheaval, which tore apart the earth underneath it. Underneath it. Fura believes the Princess Ella may have called out you from deep in the earth. Join the search for the princess below. That makes sense because she fell down when we was under the castle. So we're gonna join the search for the next episode. So let me just... This is a nice place to end the episode on. If you have enjoyed this episode, please consider liking this video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Now, from next episode, the game will officially begin. We're done with the tutorial. I'm super hyped. You will probably see the next episode here in a couple of hours uploaded. This has been 23. I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.